to get that through. Jonki, the defender, was the first one out. Here's a chance. In on goal. Shot and just goes wide. Smith, irate with his defense, that able to walk past everyone was Alex Trujillo. And Trujillo gets back, and again, what a standing his ground. Kobat playing it off. Here's an opportunity. Ramsey, nice sliding tackle there by... Shielding off his man, but Trujillo, and here's a ball, and onside, very onside. Cisternino in, right foot. Back again is Jamal Smith. What a savior this man has been this game. That's his third shot that he's deflected in obvious scoring position. We, uh, we have an insider in the truck in uh, Jeremy Milani, our producer who uh, hails from South Africa. Do you think he'd, he'd have a for Portugal FC? And now a great ball. Sister Nino. Smith getting back, getting into position, going into the box. Smith's going to have to be accurate. He was. But the ball, nonetheless, will go out for a corner kick. And a great little duel by Jamal Smith. We've seen what he can do all year. And here, just gets into his defensive position. As soon as the attacker makes the move, he will surrender the corner. Into thread by the defenders for Portugal FC. Here's Dimitrov. Dimitrov. And he'll, he'll put it out with the kick on the left side. And again, Jamal Smith coming up to block anything in sight. He's he, a pillar out there he, on defense. He certainly is. We picked a good day to pick him for our profile player because he's illustrating right now how valuable he is to this team. On the attack, good and nice little through ball flicked on. Giving Chase is our towel. Closing is Smith. He's shielding him. Trying to get past his man and bumped off it. A good job by Big Jamal Smith. Pass through the middle. Three on three rush now for the Montreal Impact Academy. Through the middle. Aru off to the left side, shot blocked by Smith and Elizavich. Move back from the midfield position, he'll take that left back position. Tismanar on the attack, Smith just looking to get it up to a strike. The middle here, Kobat laying it off to his left. Trouble controlling it was Grigore. He's into the area. So we'll take another look at De Tomasis' ball. Finds Lecky, and again, we said that these two would duel all game, and they have, and they will, and not a whole lot there in terms of a clear. Second opportunity for Serbia White Eagles as they get into the danger zone. Here's Sean Brown looking to set it up. Brown looking to deke around the man. No, the ball is going to go off a defender and out of the... And the ball, that's always the key element. Jamal Smith, hampered there by Shimale Smith. Still a good body position, and he, but unfortunately, Dimitrov couldn't hit the net with it. And Jamal Smith, our spotlight player for Rogers TV, is uh, very tall, and there he is with the ball. Yep. The sidelines, no space up, looking for Gooden, but Gooden was well back. He'll find it. On the corner of the box, no one in, trying to get past two men on his own. The best he'll do is get a corner. Gets past two defenders. Grigori now up the left wing. Inside the box now. And that attempted cross. Bardo now back to midfield. Up through the middle and it gets past Luke. And a quick reaction play there by Jamal Smith. To the Lions were not a part of. Ball popped up. First the ball is a Blanche now and it's popped up. They'll set up for the corner, but again, trying to figure out the formations. And that's uh, that's going to definitely play a part in the second half to see. Box. Right curl into the box. Headed out of harm's way. And once again, it was Jamal. Matika sending it three quarters of the length of the field. And it's headed back to mid. Network or Discovery Channel. Something like hold the line, right, in a battle. Well, it's the same thing here. They held their held. They stuck to their guns. They had a, a play. offensive pressure here for Portugal FC as that's curled inside, and it's a goal off the head of the Portugal FC. Issue, perhaps a little lucky not to be booked. As the intention was to go to the ball, but it didn't really. Well, from the right side, there's a cross into the box, and it gets headed out of bounds. Awada now back. Here's a. Pass from. Thank you very much, Karma. Thank you.
All right, we're going to send it back upstairs now to Ben Ennis and Cal McClellan. Guys, take it away. Hey. And it was those five goals in the playoffs last year that we mentioned before that were just, you know, absolutely phenomenal. Did and the assistant referee's flag went skyward. We're in the 62nd minute. Jarek White. An offensive opportunity here as we are, are approaching halftime at Lamport Stadium. Smith maybe trying to create. I think anyone who's in the King and Dufferin area should come out here every. People forgot about Todd Gill, but I'm bringing him back in a big way. If anyone's doing the math at home, they can maybe tell me. Great turn there by Smith. I don't think Todd Gill could do that. Didn't have much going up the field, so they'll play it as far as midfield. Or it was Kobad, the lone offensive player for the Astros. Portugal FC now with it, left with it. Masterovic, Smith. Smith trying to hook up with Jarek White. Dangerous area here now. Cleared back to midfield. Smith through the middle. Smith taken down. Smith on a... To be a lot of chances for the remainder of this game. Down a man with Hugo Herrera, one of the strikers sent off here in the 38th of the second half goes to Portugal FC heading from right to left played after that for a good half an hour so you don't think that that had something to do with it injury wise but perhaps get someone else on some fresh legs as this ball is headed down the near sideline roughly two weeks since we've seen the shooters on the pitch and played a game in a while due to rainouts various competitions it's tight both keepers is none really having to pounce off their line too much maybe one combined so far in the end but it's what happens when we get closer taken by Portugal FC maybe not a wise play now on the run comes the impact Academy through the middle Awada Awada working on three defenders this year that the Montreal Impact Academy would be the feeder team for the Montreal Impact so many of the players of course the same Smith trying to create some defense here and some separation. And Jamal Smith has been one of the strongest defenders early in this game. Star striker like him. Looking to thread it. Berlotic. Mohamed Kanu. First of the ball is Smith. And boy, has he been solid on the back line. Big Jamal Smith.